Previously recognized as Anatolian Shepherd, the Kangal Shepherd is a breed of dog that has only been recently recognized in the UK. The breed consists of large livestock guardian dogs that hail from Sivas in Turkey. As a result, they are also often called Turkish Kangal dogs. They were used by shepherds to protect livestock from predators and have grown to be quite big for that purpose. However, despite their intimidating stature, they are just gentle giants with undying love and loyalty for their humans. So follow us today as we dive into our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Kangal Shepherd Dog. But before we start our list, we'd like to take a moment to express our thanks to all the original Kangal owners on this video. The video would seriously not have been possible without them. So don't forget to check out these adorable dogs from the Instagram profiles that have been linked in the description below. And now, let's begin the list. Number 1. Their History No one really knows for sure how Kangal Shepherd breed originated. They are an ancient breed of dogs that have existed for thousands of years now and are often associated with ancient mastiff breeds. Some believe that they came from the central Anatolian town of Kangal in Turkey's Sivas province, which is also where they got their name from. However, others argue that they've might gotten their name from the Aga of Kangal family, which was a family of influential people in the Kangal district. Either way, farmers of the Sivas province have highly prized their Turkish Kangal for being an excellent guarding dog. These strong and robust dogs were used to guard livestock against predators such as wolves, jackals, and bears. They have retained their guarding dog skills and are used to guard livestock to this day, although they are also being kept as loving house companions lately. However, despite the breed's ancient history, it wasn't until October 2012 that the UKC, the official kennel club of the UK, recognized the Kangal Shepherd dog as a separate breed and classified the dogs within the pastoral group. Before that, the breed had always been classified as Anatolian Shepherd, but the standard for the Kangal now reveals more specific details. Number 2. They have a quite big build The Kangal is a large yet well-balanced dog with a big and muscular build. Males can weigh around 110 to 145 pounds and measure about 30 to 32 inches at the shoulders, while the slightly smaller females weigh 90 to 120 pounds and are 28 to 30 inches tall. The breed's history as a guard dog is what led to these giant proportions, however, having to herd livestock across vast expanses of land has also fine-tuned the Kangal Shepherd's agility and speed. They weigh less than average Mastiffs, so they can reach speeds of up to 35 miles per hour. One of their defining characteristics is their large head that is accompanied by a darker face mask. The double coat provides insulation against both severe Anatolian winters and fierce summers while also repelling water and snow. Number 3. They were rarely ever crossbred. Although prized for their guarding skills, Kangal dogs were not allowed to live in homes with their owners. This is because Muslims are not permitted to keep dogs in the house. Instead, these dogs always stayed out in the plains with the flocks. This, coupled with the fact that the dogs were only found in remote regions, led to the relative isolation of the breed, resulting in minimal crossbreeding taking place. As a result, the Kangal Shepherd has retained a strong and pure bloodline with remarkable uniformity in their appearance, temperament, and behavior. Number 4. They are smart dogs Along with a vigorous and attentive nature, Kangals are also quite smart, which might have been caused by the dogs having to live by themselves. They are sensitive and alert to changing situations, responding to threats with judicious warnings and courageous action if necessary. However, just like any other smart and independent breed, Kangal Shepherds need a firm owner who can lead their dogs. Training them can also be a hassle as they might not respond to traditional training methods. This does not mean that they are terrible learners though, they just need early and consistent training. Having said that, the Turkish Kangal is still not the best choice for novice owners. Number 5. They don't mind being left alone From spending years in the rural wilderness of Turkey without human guidance, the Kangal dog has developed a strong sense of independence. They can think and act for themselves as they are quite intelligent as well. This is why your Kangal Shepherd won't mind being left alone for a long time. So if you gotta leave your home for an extended period of time, getting a Kangal might be a good choice for you. What's more, the breed has been known to show aggression towards other animals, so getting them a companion in order to make them feel less lonely might actually be worse. Number 6. They love humans Despite having to live away from their owners for so long, Kangals have been known to love their humans to death. As a result, they've gained a reputation for being wonderful companions and family dogs. They form strong bonds with their owners and usually become devoted to one person in the household. Although your Kangal might be a little aloof towards strangers, with proper socialization, they'll welcome your guests without being shy or aggressive. They've even been known to get along with kids, which is why they make a great choice for families with children. However, they are quite protective of their family, so you'll have to take extra care when your kids bring their friends over to play at your house. Number 7. They have the strongest bite force 
Given their history of having to fend off large predators like wolves and bears, it's no surprise that Kangals are one of the strongest dog breeds out there. When suspicious, they give an alarm call and place themselves in between the perceived threat and their flock or their human. Then they try to scare the predator away and usually succeed in doing so. However, if the predator stands its ground, the Turkish Kangal has no problem resorting to physical confrontation. In doing so, the breed has been known to bite down with a force of 743 pound force per square inch or PSI, which is the strongest bite force in all domestic dogs. For reference, the average tire's presser generally falls at around 32 PSI. As such, the Kangol Shepherd has rightfully earned their spot as one of the strongest canines. Number 8. Their Health and Lifespan When properly cared for, the average Kangol Shepherd lives for about 12 to 15 years. They are robust and sturdy dogs and there are not many medical conditions that affect this breed. The lack of crossbreeding has also resulted in only a few hereditary health issues. However, that does not necessarily mean that you don't have to worry about your Kangol's health. They are large dogs, so they have a higher chance of developing hip and elbow dysplasia. And just like any other dog, common conditions like parasites, infections, and some eye problems can develop in Kangol's too. This is why it's always important to schedule a regular visit to the vet. And don't forget to only adopt your dog from a reputable breeder to ensure that they don't carry any genetic problems. Number 9. Their Grooming and Care The Kangol dog's short, dense coat sheds moderately and is fairly low maintenance. Brushing their coat a few times a week should keep them looking fine. However, these dogs do shed their coats seasonally during the spring and fall, so they'll need daily brushing during the shedding period. Only bathe their Kangol when necessary, as frequent baths can damage the natural oils in their skin. Bathing during the shedding period can also help remove dead hair and is recommended by some vets. Brush their teeth daily and trim their nails regularly. And don't forget to check their ears for infection when you're grooming your Kangol. Number 10. Kangals have been donated to Namibia Historically, one of the biggest threats to the cheetah population has come from ranchers who trapped and killed the felines to protect their livestock. This was quite prevalent in Namibia, where farmers had been losing tons of cattle and sheep to cheetahs and shooting the big cats in return. In an attempt to help both the farmers and the cheetahs, Namibia's Cheetah Conservation Fund or CCF persuaded the farmers to employ guard dogs rather than guns. As such, since 1994, around 300 Kangal and Anatolian Shepherd dogs have been given to farmers in Namibia by the CCF. With the guard dogs, livestock losses were reduced by 80 to 100 percent. Similarly, the number of cheetahs killed by farmers has fallen from around 19 per farmer annually to 2.4, the majority of which are only killed if they specifically attack livestock. The program has both conserved Namibia's cheetah population and helped farmers save a lot of trouble and money. Alright folks, with that we've come to the end of our list of top 10 interesting facts about the Kangol Shepherd Dog. Thank you so much for watching the video. Please leave a thumbs up and share the video if you liked it. Do you own one of these gentle giants? If you do, let us know about their specific traits in the comments below. Subscribe to Dogs Wiz if you haven't already, stick around for future videos and I'll see you in the next one.